Once you have begun posting your time entries, you'll need to set up your accounting system to import them. This tutorial will guide you through the importing process for QuickBooks, Time Slips, and PC Law. Start by opening QuickBooks and choosing File, Utilities, Import, IIF Files. The first time you do this, you'll need to specify the posting location, as selected in Credenza, in the import window that appears. From now on, you'll just need to select the time entries you want to import, and then click Open. QuickBooks will create new employees and customers or jobs for any incoming time entries that don't have a match already in QuickBooks. To view your newly imported Credenza time entries, view your time activities in QuickBooks. Note that while the billing rate names are transferred, the billing rate value is not, so if this isn't already specified in QuickBooks, you should do so. TimeSlips has a separate importing application that you need to use to import your Credenza time entries. Open this from Start, Programs, TimeSlips, TS Import. The first time you use it, it will ask you to locate the Credenza template. By default, this is found in your C drive under Credenza Outlook Client. Select Credenza.tpl and then click Open. A new window will now open. In the Get Data From section, specify the posting location that you selected in Credenza. Click Import to complete the process. TimeSlips will ask if you want to do a backup of the database before continuing. This won't interrupt the import process, so you may choose either option. If any Credenza time entries contain timekeepers, clients, or tasks that TimeSlips can't find a match for in its existing data, they can be created or mapped to existing items during the import. Once the import is complete, a window will open to verify the number of successfully imported time entries. Click OK and close the TS import window. You can now view your Credenza time entries in TimeSlips as slips. PC Law requires activity and task codes, so make sure these boxes are checked in the setup window of Credenza's options. PC Law uses different activity codes and names than Credenza's defaults, so before you import for the first time, you must go into Credenza's setup and click Activity Codes to match these codes and names to the PC Law terminology. Under Time Entry Options, make sure that time is formatted in tenths of an hour. And you will also need to input your PC Law Lawyer nickname in the Timekeeper ID field. The first time you import, you will also need to supply PC Law with Credenza's template. Close Credenza and open PC Law. Click on Help About PC Law and hold down the Control and Shift keys while clicking on Tech Support. Record the path beside Static, and then minimize PC Law and follow this path to the Stat Data folder. You will also need to open your computer's C drive, and then open Credenza Outlook Client and drag the Credenza.crl file into the stat data folder. This only has to be done the first time you import to PC Law. It's now ready to accept Credenza time entries. Reopen PC Law and go to File, Cost Recovery. Choose the Credenza layout and click Process. The first time you do this, you will be asked to provide the location of the files you exported from Credenza. From now on, you can just open Cost Recovery and choose the name that contains the correct date and time from when the time entries were posted and click OK to import them. Once the process is complete, a window will inform you of how many entries were accepted. Press Close to finish. 
To see the imported time entries, open your time listings. Credenza integrates seamlessly with your accounting system, allowing you to bill more effectively for your time. Once you've completed the initial setup, you are able to bill more quickly and easily for tasks you do every day. Thanks for watching.